a lot of people carry out heavy drinking or binge drinking on the weekends or on holidays. Being a nervous system depressant that it is, alcohol can quickly turn a fun night into a tragedy. Alcohol poisoning may begin slowly, with signs similar to being drunk. But as time goes on and your body struggles to process all that much alcohol introduced into your bloodstream, overdose and poisoning can happen. Identifying signs of alcohol poisoning is the first step to saving a life. A lot of people carry out heavy drinking or binge drinking on the weekends or on holidays. Being a nervous system depressant that it is, alcohol can quickly turn a fun night into a tragedy. Alcohol poisoning may begin slowly, with signs similar to being drunk. But as time goes on and your body struggles to process all that much alcohol introduced into your bloodstream, overdose and poisoning can happen. Identifying signs of alcohol poisoning is the first step to saving a life. What is the difference between being drunk and alcohol overdose? Both alcohol overdose and drunk share similar symptoms such as confusion or vomiting. There isn't much difference between being drunk or suffering from alcohol poisoning. The mechanisms behind the two are the same. Alcohol is dulling systems within the body and mind. The only difference is that when a person suffers alcohol poisoning, they've had far too much to drink and alcohol's dangerous effects on the mind and body are magnified to a deadly level. Here are some signs of an alcohol overdose. Pale skin, blue skin, clammy skin, inconsistent breathing, coma, difficulty remaining conscious, hypothermia, low body temperature, regular breathing, this can be 10 seconds or longer between breaths, or fewer than 8 breaths per minute. Seizures, slow heart rate, dulled responses, such as no gog reflex, and vomiting. What is the difference between being drunk and alcohol overdose? Both alcohol overdose and drunk share similar symptoms such as confusion or vomiting. There isn't much difference between being drunk or suffering from alcohol poisoning. The mechanisms behind the two are the same. Alcohol is dulling systems within the body and mind. The only difference is that when a person suffers alcohol poisoning, they've had far too much to drink and alcohol's dangerous effects on the mind and body are magnified to a deadly level. Here are some signs of an alcohol overdose. Pale skin, blue skin, clammy skin, inconsistent breathing, coma, difficulty remaining conscious, hypothermia, low body temperature, regular breathing, this can be 10 seconds or longer between breaths, or fewer than 8 breaths per minute, seizures, slow heart rate, Dulled responses, such as no gog reflex, and vomit. What to do if someone has alcohol poisoning? You should call 911 immediately if you suspect someone is showing signs or symptoms of alcohol overdose or poisoning. Things can worsen and quickly become deadly. Paramedics and doctors can save their life. While waiting for emergency responders to arrive, your 911 operator may instruct you to lay the person on their side to prevent choking. After the immediate threat of alcohol, overdose has been overcome. Treatment is required to address the alcohol use disorder. Most treatment centers offer alcohol treatment and detox services to help people overcome struggles with alcoholism and binge drinking. What to do if someone has alcohol poisoning? You should call 911 immediately if you suspect someone is showing signs or symptoms of alcohol overdose or poisoning. Things can worsen and quickly become deadly. Paramedics and doctors can save their life. While waiting for emergency responders to arrive, your 911 operator may instruct you to lay the person on their side to prevent choking. After the immediate threat of alcohol, overdose has been overcome. Treatment is required to address the alcohol use disorder. Most treatment centers offer alcohol treatment and detox services to help people overcome struggles with alcoholism and binge drinking. How do you fix minor alcohol poisoning? Call 911 immediately and ask for help. Keep them awake in an upright position. Provide them water to sip and stay hydrated while they are awake. Keep them warm. Cover them with a warm blanket. Is our video helpful? Like it, share, and subscribe to our channel.